Hey there, everybody. Good morning. Welcome to this uh, magnificent Monday. My name is Tom Rigsby, your uh, host for this morning. Thank you so much for being here. First, a big thank you for giving me the opportunity to take care of some things last week. I, I wrote in a post last Monday that every day I try to give you guys the best that I have, and um, I just didn't have it last week. Had family emergency that we were taking care of, and so thank you for your patience with that. I appreciate that. And I am back today. Be back every day this week. As long as, what's the old saying? As long as the creeks don't rise? I don't know, something like that. Be back every morning. Hey, when you get here, if you'll drop your name in a howdy down, <coughs> excuse me, drop your name in a howdy down in the comments, let me know that you're here. That would be awesome. I love to hear that and see that. Hey, good morning, Ramona and Karen. Good to have both of you here. I really appreciate that. All right, so today, got a great title. <laughs> I think a great title. Let's make Monday great again. You know, so many people that I, I mean, I, and I, I talk to them all the time. I'm sure you talk to them all the time. Oh, it's Monday. It's it's so bad that in one of my favorite work movies ever, uh, Office Space, they made a play on it. You know, somebody's got a case of the Mondays. Monday is just this. Ah, oh, terrible downer of a day. Um, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Monday's a bad day, apparently. But if we look at it from a different perspective, we might have a better day. That's what I want to share with you this morning, give you just a, a little smidge of a chance to, uh, to reframe your Monday, as it were. So let me check here. All right, good. Everything is still going. You guys are awesome. All right. Monday, for most of us, Monday is the first day of the week. That means that's the first opportunity that we have to have a great impact on the world. How about that for reframing? Instead of thinking, oh, i got to go back to work. Oh, I get to go help people achieve their goals. I, I get to go, you know, however it is that you contribute to people reaching their goals, finding their success, making something magic happen in their lives. Today's the first day you get to do that. First day of the whole week. And if you take if, if you approach it from that perspective, I promise you the rest of your week is going to look better. I actually have a picture. I was trying to get it done before I started uh, this morning, but I ran out of time. The dog and I went for a walk this morning, took a fantastic I tried to take a fantastic picture of a wonderful uh, sunrise. We'll see how it turns out. I'm going to put that up on Instagram. I'll show up here on uh, Unashamed Nonconformist also. But it just reminded me, you know, that from one particular point of view, the whole world can open up to you. And if you begin, I mean, this, you know, we've talked about gratitude before and how if you start each day with a sense of gratitude, it's impossible to express gratitude and selfishness at the same time, right? If you are expressing gratitude, you automatically have to be thinking outward. And if you are thinking uh, outward, how can I help other people? What value can I bring to other people today? Then your mind, you're going to put that question in your mind, your mind's going to go to work for it, and things are just going to start showing up. Have you ever bought a new car? And then as soon as you get it, you notice them all over the road. I did that not too long ago, got a new car, new to me. And as I'm driving it around, now I see it. And not just the same make and model, same color, same trim. It looks exactly like mine. I had never noticed them before. And <clears throat> these opportunities to help people create value and make Monday great again are going to start showing up. When you give your mind that question to work on, how can I create value for the people around me today? Then your mind will start working on that. It will begin to show you opportunities. Then it is up to you to take action on those and make them a reality. All right? That's it for today. That's all. 
It's actually going to come in on right at seven minutes. How about that? Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Again, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for uh, sticking with me last week. I hope some of the messages that I left uh, helped you through the week were inspirational. We'll be back every day this week with a show tomorrow, uh, back here at 7 o'clock for 7 minutes. Then we've got, uh, let's see, talk radio for entrepreneurs at 8 o'clock. Got a great guest tomorrow. I think you will enjoy his message also. And then coffee shop show on Wednesday, I think we're both going to be there. It's just going to be a good week this week, and it starts with a magnificent Monday. Thank you again for being here. I look forward to talking to you again tomorrow. And now, the same way I did. Oh, wait. Before I go, comments. So, Mondays are the new beginning to make it a better week than the week before. Look at last week as a learning lesson. And that's from Ramona. Thanks, Ramona. And get to is a whole, yep, then have to, absolutely. We get to. We have an opportunity. And you know, Ramona, uh, to your point about using last week as a learning opportunity, I, on my uh, daily sheets where I keep up with what I'm doing every day, down at the bottom is a little section. I label it recap, but it's just what went well and what didn't go well. And I try to do that at every planning unit, whether it's a day, a week, a month, a quarter, a year. You know, what things worked well and what things could we do better? If we're always looking at that, um, then that's we're, we're going to improve. Now, a lot of people will get stuck on what did not go well. Don't do that. That's why I lead with what went well. Start the, start the review with the things that did go well. And that puts you in that positive um, mental frame. And then sometimes you'll actually come up with the answer. And when you're examining what went well, you'll come up with the answer to what can we do better. All right. Good comments. Again, if you're watching live on the replay, drop me a note down there. Let me know that you were here. Thank you one and all for being here today. And I'll give you a little bit of an outro as I gave you an intro. I'll see you tomorrow right here on 7 Minutes in the Morning.